Big news, folks. We have a groundbreaking update that could change the lives of millions of Americans. A federal judge has given the green light to President Biden's ambitious student loan forgiveness plan, marking a significant milestone in the ongoing battle against student debt. This monumental decision means that millions of Americans could soon see their student debt shrink or even disappear entirely, offering a fresh start to those burdened by financial stress. For countless borrowers who have been struggling under the weight of student loans, this is a huge victory. Imagine the relief of finally being free from the constant worry of mounting debt. This decision is not just a win for individual borrowers, but a major step towards tackling the broader student debt crisis that has been holding back millions of Americans for years. The burden of student loans has long been a barrier to financial freedom and economic mobility. With this ruling, there is renewed hope that future generations will not have to face the same overwhelming financial challenges. It also underscores the importance of financial literacy and responsible borrowing. It's about time someone did something about this massive problem. The approval of this plan is a testament to the power of collective action and advocacy. It shows that when people come together to demand change, real progress can be made. As we move forward, it's crucial to continue the conversation about higher education affordability and the need for systemic reforms. This decision is a significant step, but it's just the beginning of a larger journey towards a more equitable and just financial system for all. Lawmakers and policymakers will need to work together to ensure that this plan is implemented effectively and that it truly benefits those who need it most. The road ahead may be long, but today's news is a beacon of hope for a brighter financial future. So let's celebrate this victory and look forward to a future where education is a pathway to opportunity, not a lifetime of debt. Stay tuned for more updates as this story continues to unfold. For many Americans, this ruling brings a wave of relief. Imagine owing tens of thousands of dollars for an education that hasn't quite panned out as promised. That's the reality for many borrowers. This decision means people can finally breathe a little easier. They can start planning for the future without the constant burden of student debt. It's about having a fair shot at achieving the American dream. Biden's plan isn't about giving handouts to everyone. It focuses on those who need it most, people who borrowed more than they can afford to repay, folks stuck in repayment for decades, and those tricked by shady for-profit colleges. This plan is about fairness. It's about giving people trapped in a cycle of debt a chance to get back on their feet. It's about investing in the future of millions of Americans. Of course, not everyone is happy. Some Republican-led states are throwing a tantrum and suing to block the plan. They claim it's unfair to those who didn't go to college or already paid off their loans. These arguments ignore the fact that this plan helps everyone by boosting the economy. When people aren't drowning in debt, they can buy homes, start businesses, and contribute more to society. Section 5. Education Department Stands Firm, Defending Loan Forgiveness. The Department of Education isn't backing down. They're fighting tooth and nail to defend this plan and ensure borrowers get the relief they deserve. They know how important this is for millions of Americans. This isn't just about politics. It's about doing the right thing. It's about helping people improve their lives and achieve their dreams. It's about time someone stood up for borrowers. Section 6, A Bump in the Road potential impacts of GOP opposition. The legal challenges from Republicans might slow things down, creating a series of obstacles that could delay the implementation of the student loan forgiveness plan. These challenges often come in the form of lawsuits and legislative maneuvers designed to question the legality and fairness of the proposed measures. However, despite these hurdles, they won't stop this plan entirely. The Biden administration, along with its supporters, is steadfast in its commitment to seeing this initiative through. They are working tirelessly behind the scenes, navigating the complex legal landscape to ensure that the plan remains on track. The Biden administration is determined to make student loan forgiveness a reality for millions of Americans. This initiative is seen as a crucial step in alleviating the financial burden on young professionals and families providing them with the economic freedom to pursue their dreams and contribute positively to society. It's frustrating to see politicians put their own interests ahead of the needs of the people. 
The opposition often frames their arguments around fiscal responsibility and fairness, but many see these actions as politically motivated, aimed at undermining the current administration's efforts, but we're confident that justice will prevail. The courts have a critical role to play in this process, and there is hope that they will recognize the broader benefits of the student loan forgiveness plan. Legal experts and advocates are optimistic that the judiciary will uphold the administration's efforts, and borrowers will eventually get the relief they've been promised. This relief is not just about financial aid, it's about restoring hope and providing opportunities for a better future. The positive impact on individuals and the economy as a whole could be substantial, leading to a more educated and financially stable population. Section 7, What's Next? Navigating the Legal Maze The legal battle over student loan forgiveness could go on for a while, it might even end up in the Supreme Court. But one thing is clear, this fight is far from over, we'll be watching closely as this case makes its way through the courts. In the meantime borrowers should know that they have allies fighting for them every step of the way. Section 8. A Brighter Future. The Promise of Student Loan Forgiveness. Despite the legal challenges, there's reason for optimism. The judge's ruling is a sign that the tide is turning in favor of borrowers. Student loan forgiveness is within reach. Imagine a future where people aren't crippled by student debt, a future where everyone has a fair shot at success regardless of their background. That's the future we're fighting for. Section 9. Looking ahead, the long-term implications. This is about more than just canceling debt. It's about understanding the broader impact on our society and economy. It's about addressing the systemic issues that created the student debt crisis in the first place. The roots of this crisis run deep, affecting millions of students and graduates. It's about making college affordable for everyone. Education should be a pathway to opportunity, not a financial burden. The fight for student loan forgiveness is just the beginning. We need comprehensive reforms that address the cost of higher education and the financial barriers that many students face. We need to keep pushing for reforms that make education a right, not a privilege. This means advocating for policies that support free or reduced tuition, increased financial aid, and better support services for students. We owe it to ourselves and future generations to create a more just and equitable society. By addressing these issues now, we can ensure that future generations have the opportunity to succeed without the burden of overwhelming debt. The long-term implications of student debt are far-reaching. It affects not only individual financial stability, but also the broader economy. High levels of student debt can lead to delayed home ownership, lower rates of entrepreneurship, and reduced retirement savings. By tackling the student debt crisis, we can create a more vibrant and dynamic economy. Graduates will have more freedom to pursue their passions, start businesses, and contribute to their communities. It's also important to recognize the role of community colleges and vocational training programs. These institutions provide valuable education and training that can lead to well-paying jobs without the high cost of traditional four-year colleges. Ultimately, the goal is to create a system where education is accessible and affordable for all. This will not only benefit individuals but also strengthen our society as a whole. We must continue to advocate for change and work towards a future where education is a right, not a privilege.